And the world turns And the world turns And the world turns And the world turns Elvis sang that. Ever since I've been young, I've had a dream about going into space, lying there in the darkness and staring down, watching continents drift by and come round again. Drift by and come round again. I always want to launch myself from space and dive down up through the atmosphere, through the clouds and the air, and swoop over the heads of people walking and talking and shopping in Moscow or Paris or Rome. Or wherever. I'd be moving so fast that I'd just have time to see their astonished faces before I was off again, back up to my space base. Which could be anything really, an asteroid, a moon or a spaceship. It's never really been that clearly defined in my dreams. But it's not important. Just to be in space would be the important thing. Just to be in space would be the important thing. spoken to lots of people about my desire to go to space and they think it's stupid they say to me things like what about the training? I hear it's very hard I say hard? hard my arse a couple of assault courses and a maths test piece of piss I've suffered worse than that I've suffered much worse than that Sometimes I wonder what's gone wrong with people. I think they've gone simultaneously soft or stupid, or they're living in fear. But I don't know why. There's nothing to fear about space. Space is brilliant. Space is brilliant. And I've told people, that I'd pay a million pounds to go to space, which is true. I'd pay a million pounds or more to go for an hour, or even half an hour, although a day would be better. A day in space. That would be something, a day in space. That would be something. I speak to people sometimes and I ask them, well what would you do if you had a million pounds? If you wouldn't take it to space, what would you do with it? They say, I don't know, buy a house or a car, maybe take a holiday somewhere. A holiday where, I ask them. Oh, Spain, Egypt, see the pyramids maybe. See the pyramids maybe. When they say this to me, I look at them. I look at them straight in the eye and I wait for just a few seconds just so they know that what I'm going to say is going to be important. What I'm going to say is going to be important. And then I say, what better place could you go to than space? What's a better holiday than that? Think about lying there when you're 100, 110 or whatever, looking back at your life and thinking, well, what did I actually do? What did I actually achieve? Oh yeah, I saw the pyramids. Big deal. You can probably see those from space anyway. You see all the rest of the blue and green globe twisting and turning below you. You can see the sun lighting up the moon. Feel the stars shining down upon your back. You don't get that in Egypt. 
you don't get that in the pyramids. And you don't get that by pissing away your million pounds on something that everyone else can do if they save up long enough. Elvis sang that. 